We've 100% been on AWS since day one, and so it's been a competitive advantage for us because we can build full architectures and break them down at will without having a lot of capital expenditure. My name's John McLaughlin. I'm the Director of Engineering for DevOps at Fixu. Fixu is a mobile advertising optimization platform. We make sure that um, when we deliver an ad that we get it to the right location. So if you have a segment of a demographic that you're looking to deliver to, we ensure that you're going to get the maximum exposure to those demographics. We've been on AWS since 2007 and we chose it because it was clearly much easier to leverage uh, quickly building and breaking down instances. Our company has exploded in growth. So Fixu as a company has more than doubled every year and in doing so, dealing with sort of the scaling problems has been significantly reduced on AWS. For instance, if you need to grow a, a fleet of machines that are running an element in your system, you can just press a couple buttons and you end up having uh, additional resources at your fingertips. Fixu uses AWS basically at, at every level in our, our uh, production platform, from compute instances all the way down to databases, the number of requests that we're receiving is reaching the multi-billion mark now, and we're able to process a lot more information much quicker because we're able to auto-scale, um, scale up and scale down as we need, and we're able to uh, tie together services such as you know, queues and things like that that allow us to take information and manipulate it and move it along uh, reliably. The way that Fixu uses AWS instances is that the moment you guys release a new instance, we migrate to it. We already know that AWS has taken the time in the background to figure out the, the optimal performance uh, format for their systems. And we rely on that to guide our, our own business. And we trust that the newest processors and the best technology from Intel is gonna be in those machines. When AWS announced the M3 class, R3 class, I2 class, and C3 classes, we actually 100% turned over our entire infrastructure to these newer class of machines because the advantage is so great. You gain a 15% uh, boost in your efficiency using these newer classes of Intel CPUs. The fact that the Xeon has so much density to each processor allows us to inexpensively be able to determine how many machines and what size machines we need in our workload. And in fact, when the C4 uh, line of servers were exposed today, we already uh, changed our entire strategy around how we operate our environment. And the moment that those machines are available to us, we will be launching as many of them as we can to support our infrastructure. On AWS, we started with your sort of typical, we run servers running Linux and we run databases uh, all on EC2. As more and more features came out around DynamoDB and SQS and other services that became available, we, we realized that uh, more and more that we were going to be migrating our environment from running Linux on our own machines to using services and, and tying those services together. We basically use every service in AWS's suite except for a, a small handful. So in our case, um, whenever you guys release a new service, similar to whenever you release a new type of machine, we rely on that to guide our business.